Hello, my name is Eduardo. I'm a Game Art VFX Animation lecturer at SA UK. Uh, so the most rewarding moment at SA as a lecturer is to see the students go from zero to heroes in such a short period of time. So in 12 weeks, I've seen like really good pieces of work and identified natural talents within the students and then push those talents forward. We will, we will communicate within course, you will talk about of course and um, our projects and how they're going. So it's almost, almost like a company as well as a group of friends studying a giant course. So. There's always opportunities to cross collaborate with a film student even game students. We have cases where uh, actual VFX students have decided to collaborate with film students where they're helping them out with certain aspects of their work. But at any time they can always collaborate with the students. So from other courses or amongst themselves to create something larger. What makes a course special is uh, the fact that it's a two-year degree course and is more condensed. Right? So that, in, that means that students have to put a lot more time into it. The skills can be, so they, involve their, they develop their skills a lot faster uh, within the two-year degree course that gets them ready for the industry. Oh, the teachers are the best when it comes to VFX and uh, we will get one-to-ones quite often and we will get our projects done. Don't get too stressed because the teachers are really willing to help and they have um, the best knowledge when it comes to um, starting from the beginning of the course and uh, learning strong uh, software that um, big companies use. I was like, oh, we get good stuff from SAE even though it's quite small. Even just having Houdini on your CV is uh, pretty good. The best piece of advice for someone who wants to start their career in VFX, whether they don't know anything at all or whether they already have some experience and when I say much time treat the course as a full-time job that's uh, my best piece of advice <laughs>